So obviously Paris is known for having some of the most famous attractions in the whole world, but there's an attraction that you guys might not know about and we are going to do it today. So before coming away to Paris, Doug and I did our usual bit of research to organise things for our trip. Doug is also French, so we asked his family if they had any recommendations, and that's when we came across Bateau Parisien. It's meant to be one of the most beautiful things to do in Paris, and people who have done this on their trip said that it made their trip. So Doug and I are really excited to take you along with us today and show you what we get up to. Parisien is a River Seine cruise boat company. They have both sightseeing boats and restaurant boats. We decided to go with the restaurant boat because we'd heard such positive things about the food and we chose the lunch cruise option. We were handed a glass of champagne on arrival as well as a map to show us all the attractions we would see along the way. As you can see on our ticket, we were served as privilege. Now there are three different dining options. We chose the middle one for 79 euros per person, meaning we were guaranteed a window seat. We also got a glass of champagne and cheese as well as dessert. And we were very happy with this dining option. Here you can also view the menu. As you can see, this is their spring summer menu, which was different to the one that we had. So keep watching because of course, I'll show you all of our food and our menu as well. we chose the window seat option and the only difference between us and the next tier up which is 99 euros per person is that they're situated at the front of the boat meaning they get an all-round view but we were super lucky to be situated at the back of the boat on the privilege service so we kind of got an all-round view as well we got views of the Eiffel Tower from behind and just generally had an all-round lovely view to be honest so we were really happy with this these people here would have been tier number one, so just to give you an idea, if you do choose that option, for 69 euros you'll be seated in the middle of the boat, so you won't be next to a window and there are some things you don't get included in your menu, but it's still a very good option. Okay, let's talk about the food and drink, I'm sure you've all been waiting to hear. Starting with the drinks, so this is a clip of our menu, so you can see under each service what is provided. As I mentioned, we were given a glass of champagne upon arrival, followed by a bottle of red wine, and then also after that a bottle of white wine. So we had quite a few drinks going here as you can see, we definitely didn't finish them all. You also get a bottle of water and you can have a coffee of your choice as well. And the one thing I will say is we never felt rushed, even when the boat trip had finished, they let us stay on the boat and finish our drinks and take in the views one last time, so that was really positive. Moving on to food, so Doug and I both picked up a French menu, but they did have English menus as well. So as I go through what we ate, feel free to pause if you'd like to read in more detail and I'll obviously give you the English translation. So these were the starter options and I chose option number three. So I had a poached egg, mousseline, roasted mushrooms, grilled bacon, and juice of a red wine reduction for the sauce, and it was divine. And Doug chose the first option, so he had potato and haddock velout with a peppery, creamy sauce, and he said it was amazing as well. Moving on to our main course, so I chose option number two, and I had duck with orange as a sort of parmentier and a parsnip mousseline. And Doug chose option number three, so he had a beef cheek braised in red wine, crone and parsnips and an onion cream. Our mains were absolutely delicious as well and we loved the presentation of all of our courses. Moving on to our next course, which was cheese. So we were given a nice slice of cheese and some baguette each. And we thought this was a really nice touch about the privilege service. We really liked having cheese before dessert. These were the dessert options. Doug and I had the exact same thing, which was the truffle chocolate. And this is what it looked like. Again, beautiful presentation and the chocolate honestly melted in your mouth. And that's everything to show you about the food and drink. I don't know if it's gonna be too 
loud because we're right by the engine. Yeah. But we've just finished our dinner. As you saw, the food was amazing. And we, we've just been allowed to step outside so that we can show you the amazing view. We've actually got someone in a hot air balloon over there. <laughs> Statue of Liberty. Statue of Liberty. So that was given to the French after the French gifted the, Statue, the real Statue of Liberty to the US. So I think this one was uh, given in 1889 and the real one was 1886. And we've been in the real one. We have been in the real one. In one of the vlogs. <laughs> so, tell us what we, what you thought. So Give us verdict, your opinion. <laughs> um, the verdict is uh, highly recommended. <laughs> it's amazing, isn't it? I think it's really worth it. We yeah. still have like yeah, half a bottle of marking. wine. <laughs> we just can't. <laughs> They're letting us finish our drinks. So they are, yeah. So when we went outside, that's where we went. We just went out that door there, and we were over on that side. Yeah. So. We're back at our hotel, guys. To be honest, they were so generous with the drinks like when you think how much we paid roughly 130 pounds and get three courses plus cheese two different bottles of wine champagne on arrival uh cafe yeah. cafe i coffee. just i just said the french way but with an english accent coffee the and views with, uh, obviously the views yeah, with the sightseeing so. and our waiter was so friendly and so like attentive and stuff like like i literally can't fault any of it to be honest yeah. Um, so you guys definitely have to come and do this when you come to Paris. The company we used, I'll leave their website linked down below. Um, but we're, I think this probably... Yeah, we did the lunch cruise. It's a bit more expensive for the dinner cruise. This is where we're going to finish today's video. I really hope you enjoyed coming to Bateau Parisien with us. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them down below. And give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Also, don't forget to hit that red subscribe button so you can catch up with the rest of my videos. Thank you so much for watching guys, and we'll see you in the next one.